Hi. Hey, please introduce yourself. Yeah. Uh, my name is uh, Tony Lin. Uh, I'm kind of a 5G to be marketing manager in, in Huawei. All right. And what do we see here? Train? Yes, this is about the ultra highway uh, uh, train uh, carriage inspection. And we use 5G and AI technology to do the quality control. Quality control yeah, of the train? Yeah, quality in inspection. And a lot of uh, things we can detect. For example, the painting, is it? Is the painting uh, qualified enough? The color paint? The color paint, yeah. And uh, many different things also? What yeah, does the scanning example, thing I, do? Let me introduce it. Actually, these two cube, yeah. these two block, actually, the color is the same. But uh, human eye, we, we can be tricked. For example, because of the background color is different, we, maybe we will think uh, this kind of a block is darker. But uh, this is about the, 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 the human eye fault. But, All right. But 5G camera uploading the, the image and the videos to the cloud and we do some high performance computing. In this way, we can make sure the currency is very high to uh, meet uh, the industrial uh, requirement. All right. So the color is different, no? You see, from, from your perspective, it's different, but actually, these two block, it is the, the same color. Oh, wow. Yeah. Cool. And, uh, and uh, about the 5G to be in the global market, the development is very uh, quick. Actually, we can say now 5G, 5G to be after four years de development, now 5G to be is in the, in the fast lane. And uh, including the uh, mobile operators, private uh, network revenue, and also the industrial connection, it's been tripled in 2022. And what's more important, every $1 5G to, to be revenue can bring 10 times of uh, DICT revenue, including the data, IoT, and uh, uh, cloud platform. This kind of uh, uh, revenue can be brought by 5 g to be And besides of that, uh, we see a lot of uh, 5 g to be uh, cases in China before, but now we see a lot of uh, uh, commercial launch in the overseas market, especially, for example, in the, uh, the, the smart oil, smart factory, and also smart port in Europe, and uh, smart mining in Thailand and uh, South Africa. A lot of uh, uh, commercial launch has, uh, has been a factor in the global market. And uh, behind that, we have two kinds of support. One is the, from the 5G network cap capability perspective. For example, the, the high uplink uh, and the uh, stable latency per precise positioning, this kind of uh, ability help the 5G to uh, step in the core production uh, pr procedure. And the other part is the, about the ecosystem. From, from 5G enabled system, ecosystem to 5G inside the ecosystem. So it's, it's deep converged with the industry. So 5G to be means to business? Yeah, to business, to enterprise. Every, every vertical Every vertical enterprise. And, and it's just changing the whole industry. Yeah, yeah. Change the way, uh, for example, change the way enterprise produce, change the way uh, enterprise uh, uh, manage their, 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 uh, their uh, company and change the way they uh, earn the money and create uh, revenue. Right. Uh, what do you, you show here? This is about the uh, uh, ecosystem uh, prospection. It's a 5G inside tree. So a lot of uh, terminals we have 
together with our ecosystem partner. These all from our ecosystem partner. So they pro pro produce uh, this kind of uh, support. support. And it, help, it helps the 5G to be to, uh, uh, to achieve the commercial launch in the global market. And this is about the red cap uh, terminals. Red cap means to reduce the capability. It's defined in 3GPP release 17. And uh, why we need the red cap? Because a lot of uh, scenario, 5G uh, performance, uh, for example, we don't need uh, so much high performance uh, other than the, 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 the cell phone. For example, in the wireless sensor scenario, we just need to upload uh, the data and sometimes it need to, we need uh, to do some remote control. So you are so the latency is the key, not the not the uh, upper uploading rate. So reduce the capability. Those capability is just about the uh, the speed rate, and the other other ability of five G we can inherit, inherit. Yeah. Lower module cost, yeah. 20% lower terminal power, and uh, 10 times of network capacity compared to 4G. And now we we are working we working together with uh, uh, operators in China uh, to do some commercial pilot, especially for example the smart manufacturing and also the smart city scenario applications. And what's happening in Guangdong, Fujian? Guangdong, Fujian, for example, uh, we do some uh, commercial pilot, so RedCap can can, set, uh, can satisfy most of the uh, use cases uh, uh, requirement in the smart manufacturing. So we forecast that RedCap will be the main technology in the smart man manufacturing uh, usage. Right. So it's a big deal. Yeah, it's, it's not just 5G, it's better using 5G all over the world. Yeah, yeah. and uh, we want to uh, emphasize that the ecosystem is ready for commercial launch. And uh, it will be more and more uh, types of uh, terminal by the end of 2022. And uh, the number will be more than 50. And so this is uh, RedCap. Uh, camera we can see this is ver uh, our Song Shanghai Huawei IND Center campus surveillance the video we can see a lot of uh, things actually we can zoom in to show it's a zoom? the dock the dock the dock we can see a lot of uh, details this is a zoom camera yeah zoom in zoom out And uh, actually, we have a lot of animals in our R&D center campus in the lake area. So sometimes we can find this kind of uh, uh, animal. I zoom. Yeah.